what is up everybody it is your boy matt turner back again with another video um and eh. anyways um i just got back from my post-op my second two-week post-op with dr richard santucci of the crane center and so far things have been going super duper well um, they were very impressed with my healing so far i have like small wound separation occurring nothing like big they actually said that um if all of their patients had like the type of wound separation that i have that that would be like amazing like that would be doing really really well so i haven't seen the wound separation so it's small enough that i can't even see it without you know somebody else taking a picture or showing it to me so it must be incredibly small um I will get to finally start voiding trials um, starting Sunday night, um, which they told me will require me to stop taking my oxybutin, um, which I'm terrified of because my bladder spasms, um, that's actually probably the most difficult thing that I've had to deal with is my bladder spasms. Um, and uh, what else? Uh, they gave me they took out all the staples in my arm um, and the one that I found in my leg. Um, my split thickness graph, uh, zero, form, zero form dressing has finally started peeling off. It's almost like three fourths of the way off. I have like a little sliver left um, that I am waiting to have fall off. Um, and as a reminder, that is daily showering is very important because that helps with that falling off so um just a reminder with that that if you are you know maybe not showering you're wondering why your zero form's not coming off maybe it's because you should be showering um so that's going really good uh my girlfriend finally got into town so that's really dope um fun fact i've actually been doing this all by myself for the past two weeks i haven't had a single person here she finally got here um and so i'm really really happy um but outside of the hospital stay i've been here completely alone by myself doing everything um the first two days were difficult and after that it was completely fine um honestly um i will go more into depth on why that happened and occurred um, because it was not intentional, not like intentional, intentional. Um, it was intentional in the sense that I was not going to do my original plan because it fell through, but it was not part of my original plan to be doing this alone and by myself. Um, so yep, first two weeks went by great considering I did this all alone. Um, what else? Uh, boop, 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 boop. Huh. That's really it. That's really all they did. They gave me some meds, some more meds. They gave me antibiotics that I should, I'm going to have to start taking after my catheter comes out. So thank God for that. I did get an oxybutin refill. Um, so I have that again because, again, that's like my little saving grace for this entire thing. And they also gave me um, medical cocaine. Um, I probably won't be taking that. Um, um, <laughs> but, um, yeah, they gave that to me. I was not expecting that. Um, but the lady gave it to me and I was like, okay, I, I guess, I don't know. Um, it was dirt cheap due to my insurance. So it was kind of whatever, but they also gave me like a ton of it. So I don't know. The math isn't mathing because I only have like another, what, 10, 10 days here. And they gave me like 40 pills. Um, <laughs> they're trying to get me addicted. No, I'm joking. Um, what else? I don't know. I'm, I'm really happy. Um, voiding trials are going to start. They said everything looks good. Um, they want me to stop putting uh, bacitracin, uh, bas bacitracin, bacitrine. Um, however you pronounce it, Neosporin. They want me to stop putting that on uh, my phallus. Um, they said it's a little too moist. 
um, and I can stop doing that now. So that's great because I was getting tired of doing that anyways. Um, and uh, yeah, I'm, everything's going good. I don't really have too much to update that's like crazy willy nilly. Um, they said my arm graft is doing really well. Um, and now that they took the staples out, it feels absolutely amazing. Um, the staples really were probably the worst part of it all. Um, and yeah. Just happy to have social company. That's probably been the hardest part about being here <laughs> by myself for two weeks is not having, uh, uh, social contact outside of like the hotel staff and like food <laughs> when I go get food and like my Ubers because I don't talk to my Ubers either um so yeah that yeah I've been doing all of this stuff by myself I've been showering by myself I've been doing my dressings by myself I've been getting up by myself I've been getting my food by myself um it wasn't difficult outside of the first two days um, and I will go more in depth on what those first two days were like because those first two days were rough. They were like really, really rough, like dark night of the souls rough. Um, but yeah, that's it. Uh, I will see you guys later. I hope you guys have a great morning, evening, day or night, wherever you guys are. Um, hit the like button, comment down below if you have any questions, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you guys can stay up to date on when I post videos and yeah that's it peace out